China, with a history of more than 5,000 years, is full of mysteries. Many monarchs use Peking as a capital, a city full of legendary tales. In about the year of 1899, a German professor noticed in the nearness of Peking city, the drugstores were selling an odd herb. They call it dragon bone powder. It was used as an aphrodisiac and also an antitoxin. Even if not sick, they say, it could prolong life. Under his careful analysis, he found it was not the bone of a dragon, but that of a human being. When news of that spread around the world, scientists were astonished. They all came to China to find the dragon bones. The Rockefeller Foundation of the United States applied to the Chinese government immediately to subsidize the Peking Union Medical College and the Chinese Geological Bureau for joint research. From 1927 onward, they excavated a dragon bone hill of Chou Tian. They finally dug up the fossil of a man's skull. World anthropologists were startled at the results of the finding. In some caves of the Dragon Bone Hill were the dwellings of the ape man. The living conditions of four to five hundred thousand years ago were considerably well preserved. So they named it the Chinese ape man of Peking, or simply known as Peking Man. How are you, Professor? Oh. Fine, fine. How are you? Fine, thanks. Ah. Sit down. Now, the agents from the Northern Headquarters have been mobilized. This man was sent here from Tokyo. His name is Yagyo Konomi. I heard this man is vicious. He'll assist Suzuki in getting the fossil. If they fail in this mission, then he'll have to commit Harry Carey. Oh? Uh -huh. You mean the Japanese intend to take it openly? Hmm. Why are they so interested, eh? <sighs> they want to be the first and get everything. There were excavations in South Africa, in Java. But his excavations were not recorded. Strictly speaking, there's simply not enough evidence. Unearthing the Peking man proves undoubtedly that our ancestors were apes. Not only our ancestors, our descendants, even Americans and Europeans, could be heirs of the Peking man. Even with that, 
Why are they so anxious? You must realize the Japanese emperor, Taiho spirit, militarism, are all based on fairy tales. An earthing Peking man has made all these tales go up in a great big puff of smoke. Because of that, and for safety's sake, I'm giving you one of my students. I believe you know him. He is Fang Shi Chi. Why bother? What'll he do? Well, I'm sure the Japs will trace us. But with his Kung Fu, I've asked him to be your driver. So you can take care of each other on the road. Also, I've sent another student to wait for you at the station in order to help you. Now I'll show you the dangerous zones en route. On the way from Peiping to Wanping, the Japanese soldiers have lots of people there. Hello? Yes? <laughs> this is the detailed map of Choku Tin. Call from Dragonbone Hill. Oh? Yep. Yes? Yes? Hmm. Good. Hmm. Get him here. Yes, sir. Fujita, take care of Wave Ping. Yes. Mexico, Sakura, watch the Dragon Hill and Chukaten. Right, yes. Mm. Yes. Suzuki, the car's just leaving. Besides the driver, there's Smith from the Foundation. Huh? Where's the stuff? It's in the briefcase at the back seat. Oh. Uh, uh, hello, hello, hello! Who was he calling? Hello. Uh. Our man? You mean something's wrong? Don't worry. There's still time. Inform Sakada at your good turn. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> 
is Hakada. The banks of the Russians and Old Mullings, they're the same as ours. The real one could be in Womanling's head. Let's move in. Come here. Hey. Go get that man's back. Mm. Yes. I, I beg your pardon. How long is it from here to next day? Uh, about ten minutes, sir. Uh, 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 excuse me. Uh, could you take care of this bag? Uh, I just for a can't while? do that. I'm sorry. Uh, oh, please. Just hold it for a second. I have to go there. All right. Uh, Hurry thank up, you eh? very much.
care of it. Report, sir. The Japs are fighting on board. Huh? And now many of the passengers want to get off. But what can I do? Let them be. The Japs are in power right now. I think we better not bother them. Try to calm them down, okay? Right. Good. Let's go. Watch Russian closely. Hurry. Woman is back. It's a phone. Media wants you to watch that Russian. Hey, 
Major, what happened? The back is turning. I think the Russian must have changed it. Can't be there. The Japs are trailing the Russian too. Go go there, sight then. He's here. It's in Abbott's hands right now. We just got off the train, and they're heading north. Fay and Lee are chasing him. Right. Yes. Heading north. Right. All three of them are heading in that direction. Mm. There's a parking lot. Maybe lots of people are waiting. Mm. Tell Fujita. Watch them. Right. Right. I'll go now. I destroyed a fossil. Hmm? Haven't we met before? On the train, we followed you. Why? 
do I have to draw your picture? What do you want? The same thing? I can pay you. How's Shit. that? Just give us that fossil, or it'll be your life. It's not going to be that easy. Hmm. You won't leave here alive. I'll manage. You go. I'll spare your life. Scram. <laughs> Colonel Suzuki immediately. Right. Open it. Yes. Hello. Fujita here. Colonel, we got the bag. Right. Yes. <laughs> Colonel, the fossil's not a bag. Fools! Our fools. Yes, Colonel, the bag is empty. The fossil is not in Womanling's bag. I think Womanling's train has passed Luku Bridge. We can't catch up now. Fools! Yes! Get the hell back here! Are you gonna speak up? Speak up! Hold it! Hmm? Colonel knew that the stuff isn't here. Let's go back. Yes.
Well? Uh, the bag's empty. Huh? The rewind could be his wall place. Come on. Don't you know that is illegal? In here, I am the law. Who is your superior? Me, Colonel Suzuki. I'm the commander of Northern Branch, Peking. I want to see your official representative. What? <laughs> I'm the head of this office. where we can find Fang Shi Chi. Give it to you on a plane. Mm. You have to find out where Fang is. You love to meet Fang Shiqi. Yes. Why does he belong to you?
Open it. Be a curfew tonight. Yes. What are you waiting for? Uh, Take it in. Okay. You better eat. Are you Chinese? Hmm. Bring this message. Just say the fossils is in the hands. Is it the real one? Only one in the world. It's precious. Hmm. Thank you, Professor. Hmm. All right, take it easy. Professor, huh? someone to see you. Okay. Professor. Hmm? This is a detailed map of Tungin Club. Hmm. Have a good rest. I'm going to Tungin Club. I'll go with you. No, you better lie down. If it's difficult, I'll get Yu-Gi-Oh and Suzuki out of the way. But then should I leave the fossil and save you? Or run off with it and let you die? 
The fossil is China's achievement. The Japs have no right to it. I know that. That is why our young people must protect it with our lives. I know that too. Then I have to do my part. No, please. You know that if the Japanese ever get the fossil, then they can invade China. It's not time to risk your life yet. For young people like you, there are other works. Xi <sighs> Xi. No, please don't. Huh? Mm. Suzuki's office is up here. Along the corridor are staircases, windows, and doors. And they're full of guards and alarms. They're much more cautious tonight. Please be alert. Hmm. Yagui is living downstairs, near this big hall, are the quarters for the guards. Chang, who brings meals for Wu, is also in there. Good. I'll go now. Here is an order from Tokyo. First, the Peking man. Next, it's you. No matter what the cost is, either buy it or destroy it, as our government cannot come out in the open. You are my best student. Try what you can. My mother's old, and brother's still young. That, you don't have to worry. Thank you very much. Hmm. We're relying on you. Shichi, -chi, it's time. Enjoy your meal. Where do they live? How many of you? Hmm? Inside this club. Who else is here beside you? Huh? Give it to him. Hey! <laughs> 
Take me to Suzuki's office. Quick! Or you won't return to Tokyo. Ah! <laughs> 
Peking man. is important. There's no time for the deal. Just leave Fang to me. I'm in China. You can't order me. <sighs> Michiko, she's the head of the mission. Hmm? Yes. She's the one who found Chan is a Chinese spy. She suggested to put a fossil in your room. It's all her arrangements. Otherwise, we both have to die.
Where's the fossil? It's in your goose room. Uh, uh. Where's the fossil? Where is it? They got it with the picking man. I'll go and meet him. Can't you see? Can't you see? Come and get it, if you have the guts. <laughs> you think you're tough, huh? It all depends on how you look at it. <laughs> if you're loose, would you leave the fossil here? Okay, then. It's a deal. Ah! 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 Ah!
Never mind me. Pick him. He's up there. Ah. <laughs> Frank Shee Shee. <laughs> Come and get it if you can.
discovery of Peking man revealed the living style of primitive people. The unearthing of Peking man aroused the interest of world's anthropologists, historians, and biologists alike. Although the Peking man fossil is missing and hasn't been found for many years, the value of Peking man is all the more enhanced. As to the whereabouts of the Peking man, it still remains a riddle. For almost 30 years, the needs for the missing Peking man have turned up from different sources, but up to now, none of them have been concrete enough to substantiate their claims.